morning guys it is 10 15 i'm gonna run to the grocery store ash is just having something to eat before she goes to work and pete has gone to take pictures of the um the little league action so he'll be gone i think their last game's at five or something so he'll be gone till about 6 30 but then he's going over to his mum and dad's I was telling you they were getting the bathroom changed over so it'll be wheelchair ready for his dad and whatnot um, his dad does walk with a walker and is in a wheelchair when he can't handle it but he was actually released yesterday from the rehab center so he's home again but apparently there's something where the door's not opening because of where they put the tower rack so Pete's going to go take a look at it. I'm going to run to the store now. He took my air conditioner out last night, I asked him to do it and he said he would and then he was in a lot of pain yesterday after the band comp so I didn't mention it. But around 11 o'clock last night he came up and he just did it. Katie's back tomorrow from her cruise so as of tomorrow it's back to normal. Normal Monday through Friday schedule. So I'll go this week again. All right, need to catch up with myself. I'm gonna go get my one step at a time. I'm gonna to go to the grocery store. When I get back, I will remake my list, see what else I've gotta do, and just start going through it one by one. Step one, food in the house. Talk to you in a bit. Bye guys. Okay guys, on the way to the store, I'm gonna put you there. Yeah, I do need my sunglasses. It's a beautiful day, look. Absolutely gorgeous. It is 66 degrees and it's a perfect full day. So Ash is sitting in the living room. She's gonna be leaving in about 45 minutes. Knowing Ash, she'll leave early as she always does. Anyway, I feel like the seat is higher. I feel like I'm driving a truck at the minute. Oh, it's hot. I'm not flashes, guys. Why are they? They're starting to put barriers out. I'm hoping to get to the store while it's not too crazy. No, they're all over the place. There must be some kind of um, parade gonna be happening or something after 10, 10 20 or something like that now because I'm hoping while everyone's in church I can get in and out of the grocery store and get home to get done what I want. I think I should have gone with a t shirt, but there again, when I'm out of the car, it's really breezy and beautiful. So. Wowza. There's a lot of traffic down here. Do, 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 do. Can I get through without getting stuck in the crossfire? Yes. Wow, he was mad. He just sped. Good lord, there's a lot of traffic. I was gonna go to Costco as well, but now this has just put me off. I'm just gonna go to the grocery store and back. I'll take my specs off because it's undercover parking and it's dark and I cannot see and I think what I'm gonna do I'm gonna play it safe and I'm just gonna park over here where it's kind of quiet people call around to so show you where I am okay guys I was wrong about it being empty it was packed and they've rearranged it again so I still don't know where everything is it's like 12.05 or something like that so took me an hour and a half. I bumped into a few people I knew, so of course she stopped chatting as well. And then going back and forwards over the aisles where I miss things, but I know I'll have missed something else, but that's all right, even with my list. It wasn't a full shop, but all right, guys, I am going to love and leave you now. I'm going to drive home. I'll show you what I got. I know it's gonna be very mixed because it's not really like you could say, oh, this is a week's worth of shopping and there's no meat or anything because I'm going to Costco for that. But I'm not going to go today because I want to go home and do some things now, um, namely eat lunch. And then I think I'll dust them back in my room a little later on today while I'm watching YouTube. All righty, guys. See you soon. Bye. All right, guys. Just loved everything in. And uh, boy, could you use help. But it's now 20 past 12. There's definitely going to be a parade and I'm glad I did what I had to do now because they were starting to block off all the side streets. So anyway, just figured I would show you, please excuse the mess of the rest of the kitchen. But I just figured I'd show you what I got. It's not in any order. Okay, tomato ketchup. If anybody knows me at all, I cannot be without tomato ketchup. Not for a minute, not for a meal, not for anything. I am obsessed addicted to tomato ketchup everyone knows it when my dad used to go on exercise in the army 
and they used to get rations, he always bought me a gallon back. And I know I've told this story before, but I love ketchup. Uh, some new tomatoes. Some mushrooms and some stringless sugar snap peas and some cucumbers. Garlic and herb cheese. Got some new paper plates. As I was picking my paper plates, I got into a long discussion about paper plates with one of the ladies there, and I was, you know, helping her find the best value. Some four cheese ravioli. It's getting to be that time of year. Got some new eggs. They had a special on their coffee. I know it's only a 12 pack. But caramel vanilla cream, I figure I'll give that one a whirl. Pete likes caramel, I like vanilla. Mix them up. And the, oh, that's the ceiling fan because I'm so hot, I had to put the fan on. And then Maxwell House, these are apparently new. Breakfast blend, mild. I like weak coffee, weak tea. I'm just weak. <laughs> but those were 18 and that was 9 99 Kicking onion blossom dip. So it's new by Miracle Whip Craft, so I figured I'd give that one a whirl. Even on sandwiches, I think it'd be good. And then I just saw this and I thought it looked good. Nice big chef salad. And then Lander Lakes came out with a cinnamon sugar butter spread. Uh, I just got a small loaf of bread until I can go to Costco and get my two pack. And then I saw these sandwich thins. Um, seems I've been eating a lot of sandwiches lately. Figured I'd cut it down a little bit. Honey wheat. Yeah, and they're really skinny. So, I, like a big kid, I was craving some True Moo um, chocolate milk. Let me go over here. And as I said, it's all mixed up. So, I got the Windex Touch Up Cleaner. This is a new one. It's the Orchard Apple Cinnamon. I use these like crazy. There's one there. And I'm going to put this one up in the bathroom upstairs and some paper towels under because I like to wipe it down most days. Right, guard. For Pete, and then as you know, my favorite toothpaste, the Crest 3D White Arctic Fresh. I love my fabric softeners. This is a new one I just saw, and just some marinara sauce. And then this was a new flavor pesto marinara from Prego. Just the cheddar ones, and it's getting into salsa, chips, and salsa weather. Some more ham, been going through ham like crazy, it's low sodium and uh, half a pound of turkey breast for a change. Oh, and some roll. Walking around and I was like, yes I do have potatoes, but I figured if I am alone tonight, I'm just in the mood for mashed potatoes and maybe I'll make some chicken with it. These are for Pete Nash. They both love donuts. I really don't eat these, I swear to you. Um, glazed ones. Got a lemon lime, a blueberry pomegranate, and a classic lemonade. And they're sparkling, so we'll see how they are. Bunch of bananas, microfiber kitchen cloth, and then smart living. I, you know, I like my candles lit upstairs, and I hate using matches because I have set my thumb on fire so many times. My thumbnail, I should say, not my thumb. My thumb is fine, that's fine, that's fine. But because I have wraps on, I am highly flammable. And when I was the assistant catering manager, I was going around the tables lighting the votive candles. And one day, my friend Jane turned to ask me questions, so I turned to answer her. I was still holding the match, and my whole nail was on fire, so I had a black nail for a while. So those are easier for me. I hate matches, I will use them if I have to. But I'm always worried like when you flick the match and the piece goes flying off that it's going to set a fire somewhere. So those are easy. I got one for Ash and one for me. Got Roxy some. Can't even bend right now guys. Um, companion. I'll see that over the Mighty Dog. See how it is. And then I just got another case of water which was a really good deal. It was $2.99 for the Poland Springs 24 pack. Put in the freezer already because they were starting to melt. Just got some birthday cake. Good humor ice lollies. Oh, and how could I forget? I went up the, uh, whatchamacallit aisle, what was it called? The seasonal aisle, and this little owl, he's kind of ugly cute, I don't know. I thought he was ugly, and I'm like, oh, he's kind of cute. And I'm like, no, he's ugly. And I was like, he's kind of cute. And he's got sunflowers on him, and I love sunflowers. And he's got big beady eyes, so I figured I would put that upstairs next to my candle um, because you know I love owls. So that's it guys. 
Now I'm going to go put it away. I've got my garbage bag ready to go out and then I'm going to make a sandwich and chill out for a while before I clean a bit. It's only 20 past 12. Actually, that's just 20 past 12. And this one says 27 minutes past 12. So I have a feeling my clock has gone. I need to put a new battery in. So I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye guys. Here's lunch. It's chicken salad sandwich with tomato and a big old cup of tea. It's 1.14 on September 22nd. Here's the new little owl. He's going to sit here. That's where he sits. I was able to light my candle without setting a thumb on fire. How cool is that? Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Oh yeah, my breath. It's 20 past four. I've been cleaning for like the last hour. I've just so far just dusted. Vacuums there, laundry's there, sheets to change are there. Just brought out the clean laundry to fold. Dusted all over here. Roxy does not like cleaning day. Well, it's not even cleaning day, it's cleaning rooms. Can't handle much. Um, didn't do behind the TV on the floor because I can't bend and I can't do under the bed because I can't bend. But I'm doing what I can. Pete texted and said, just in case you're trying to get hold of me, my battery's on zero, so he's not happy. I just ordered one of those Morphe's. Has anybody heard of those? I hear they're quite good, so I just ordered one for me anyway, and uh, figured the days at Pete's out and I'm home, he could take it and use it. Anyway, so yes, I just cleaned out, rearranged the top of Pete's thing real quick. Pete and his dad on the left and his granddad on the right. So this uh, frame's broken, I need to get a new one, there's no glass in it. That's my nan, my brother, and me, and then Ashley. When I was a baby, yes I was a baby one. Ashley, and then there's me, Pete and Ash, that was on Pete's mum and dad's 50th wedding anniversary last year when we went out to dinner. In this window, because we took the air conditioner out, hello, hello, and took all this makeup off here. And what I had to do, Ash had made me this case thing back in brownies when we ran a brownie troupe, but it is so nasty now and all the little flowers are beyond repair and the metal bits are all broken, so I'm finally thrown it out, which breaks my heart. But she is 20 now, it's probably like 15 years old. I used to have my brushes in it. So what I did, I just put my brushes in the birthday box because it's so pretty. This bag is all the bits and pieces from England that I need to go through still. So I just cleaned the top of this and there's the glossy box from last month, which we haven't used any of the products yet. Anyway, just want to say hello and how you doing. And oh, that is marks on my camera but i'm gonna go change the sheets and vacuum put this laundry away and um that's gonna be it for today because i'm feeling pretty ugh right now and then change before i sit on my lovely clean bed which will be clean in about 10 minutes 15 at the most anyway we'll talk to you later guys bye hey, everything's vacuumed feel good about it now because there's a lot to do this all has to go downstairs there's my little lining pile and i just have to put my duvet cover on sheets are changed so better than it was taking that blue pillow out because dogs don't really lay on it but i wanted to show you the sky of course because the sky looks nice here's all my stuff to go downstairs this is when i wish i had somebody home because you can't help me can you lou there's the garbage bag, all the laundry with the sheets and stuff off the bed, the blue pillow. Because Louie doesn't use it up here. <coughs> and the thing. I clean the bathroom. Look how gorgeous that is. The breeze is phenomenal. Alright, let me take this little lot downstairs and... Uh, Gotta get Louie off the stair. Louie, you need to pull your weight and help me. Um, Roxy's gone downstairs because she doesn't like the sound of the vacuum cleaner. But this is going to be about one, two, three trips down the stairs, and then I gotta go down the basement stairs and, <coughs> and go put this back. And then we're gonna put the duvet cover on, make a cup of tea. Louie, spotlight on your face. Lulu, look. Louis. Oh, you are fresh. Lou, there we go. Hi right, guys, I've been huffing and puffing a bit. It is now, what is it now? 
10 to 6 and I'm at this stage so I'm just going to do this bit of ironing um, just fed the puppies Roxy you look like a little angel you in Roxy don't look buddy because it's bouncing off of this Roxy doesn't like the ironing board either there's not much Roxy does like so I just made my cup of tea and uh, that's my little grey thing that puts the water in my I was going to say my kettle but that's not a kettle is it that is an iron in fact so the bed's all changed, nice clean sheets for a Sunday. Put my twinkle lights on, not that I really need them right now because, yep, it's sunny. I've not heard from Pete, like I said, his phone died and Ashley is on the schedule till six. And I believe she said she was coming home tonight, so we'll see. Everything's gone from here. And Mr. Lou is in his usual spot on the stairs. What's the sky doing? Anything new and exciting? Oh, and I just washed my bath mat so this one can go down. Uh, let's have a quick look. Oops, someone's outside. Let's see, so the sky's still pretty and the sun is going down. And everyone looks at me like I'm crazy because I'm taking pictures and the guy just looked up as I opened up the blind. What is with my makeup today? Blimey, it's really odd. Oh well, well I, don't, I don't go around walking around like that, do I? It's quite scary. Alright, so we'll see what happens. Oh, Roxy's barking at the iron. You need your backup? How about you do the ironing for me? No? She's looking at me like I'm speaking double Dutch, which I probably am to her. Doesn't Snoopy say? You just hear wah, 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 wah. Alrighty, I am really proud of myself today, if I do say so myself. I got everything, once that ironing's done, accomplished that I said I was going to do. And then, I don't know what to do for dinner now, I think I'll just have that salad. Because <sighs> I don't know what time, really, everyone's home. If Ash comes home, she'll be home soon, but she may have eaten, so we shall see. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Bye! Hey guys, everyone doing well? I hope it is now. What is it, guys? 20 past 6. Everything's done. I am now absolutely 100% done in. You laying on the nice clean pillowcase? Pete just called from his mum and dad's house. He's gonna be over there for a while. Um, and see what he can do about the bathroom, move the thing, I don't know how long he'll be. But I'm gonna go take a shower because now I feel gross from vacuuming, dusting and all that stuff. I only did my room, but you'd think I'd done everything. Too old for this, guys. I really can't do it. it. Takes a lot out of me. Ooh! If I didn't have a bad back, it wouldn't take as much out of me. But between the back and the shoulder, it's like it takes me. That took me what? Oh, I don't know. I'll see when I edit. Three hours, but I did stop in between every now and again. Um, but I actually did a lot. I threw a lot out. Three bags of um, garbage and been doing laundry in between and everything else. So. Tomorrow morning I have a nail appointment but I might do the living room when I get back before Kate comes. I'm actually going to text her parents and make sure she's still on for tomorrow. And uh, I think, yeah, Pete's working from home tomorrow and Ash has to leave again at the same time as today. She has a few more days to go before she has a day off. Um, Roxy's going to bark again. <laughs> Roxy's been barking on and off all day. Alrighty, let me go take a shower and get myself sorted and I hope everyone had a great weekend. Whatever you did, I hope Monday is not so bad for you and I will check in with you tomorrow. Bye guys. Thanks for helping me clean. Have a great, I was going to say have a great weekend. Have a great night. Bye guys. Oh, P.S. I found out what that parade was. It was the Fireman's Parade. So I heard some drums and all sorts and people are posting pictures now on Facebook. Um, it was actually the fireman, fireman's parade. Oh, and it's just gone off. Sorry about that. <laughs> but yeah, so I didn't miss a holiday. And now I don't feel so bad. I think I thought I was missing out on something or lost a day or whatever. But anyway, talk to you later. Bye.